that homelessness is not hopelessness, that there are answers if only we're willing to invest in what we know works. Tonight, Sacramento city leaders voted to accept a $64 million package from California taxpayers for homeless programs. Now, Sacramento is the only city in California to get that money, and Mayor Darrell Steinberg has set an ambitious goal of getting 2,000 people off the streets of his city. CBS 13's Macy Jenkins is live at City Hall for us, getting answers tonight on what this grant will pay for. Macy. Well, Adrian and Sam, this $64 million grant comes from California's Whole Person Care Program, a statewide waiver that's geared towards helping vulnerable Medi-Cal patients. Council members call it a game changer with more resources than they've ever had before. If you feel like this is a great day to be in Sacramento, let me hear it, and I want everybody in Sacramento to hear it. Yeah. Let me hear it. Come on. That's the sound of $64 million coming to the city of Sacramento. To help people who most frequently access emergency room services and similar services. Many of those people are from Sacramento's homeless population. Mayor Daryl Steinberg says this money will support more than 3,200 people over the next three years in a broad approach to address health issues. So how will the city use the money? First, they'll combine data from local hospitals to identify frequent ER visitors. They'll hire more clinically trained outreach workers, expand current on-the-ground outreach efforts, and develop a more comprehensive case management system. Steinberg says it'll reduce homeless visits to the ER and reduce pressure on often overcrowded local hospitals. We're going to have people at the emergency rooms. We're going to have people at the shelters. We're going to have mobile crisis teams. After four years of living on the street, Tammy Flores says she sees enough outreach workers around. They come out here, mm -hmm. you know, so I don't, I'm, he's wasting his money. She says efforts should focus on finding people a place to live. Get them in the housing and then, then start getting them to the doctors. But Steinberg says. Housing alone is not enough. The money will start coming in in July. The city will collect $32 million from 13 local hospitals and health care centers, then send the money to the California Department of Health Care Services. In return, the city receives twice as much money back from the state, $64 million in total. So why are the hospitals giving this money now? Well, they used to pay for homeless care on their own. The services will start in 2018. And next up, the city plans to hire a consulting firm to figure out just how many additional outreach workers it needs to hire. Well, this is something the mayor has been fighting for for quite some time. All right, Macy, thanks so much for that live report.